40-point victory for the Air Force Falcons as they defeat fellow Service Academy rivals Navy 90-50 to here on Veterans Day at the United States Air Force Academy in Colorado Springs. We welcome you inside Clune Arena alongside Rachel Galligan. I'm merely Roland Vargas and Rachel, what a fantastic performance that was from Air Force. Yeah, I mean, it was just a dominant performance from the start. I kept saying it started on the defensive end of the floor. The Falcons were just swarming defensively, made everything Navy tried to work for. Extremely difficult, forced 29 turnovers, 41, almost half of their points came off of those turnovers, it was a balanced scoring attack. We had a lot of players that really capitalized as we took take a look at some of these numbers. You see Navy got going a little bit later in the game, was able to capitalize on some threes, shot 33% from the three-point line, Air Force 43. Those turnover numbers, that was absolutely huge. Navy really struggling in that area, had 28 in their first game, 29 in this one. Great job for Air Force, doing a good job, taking care of the basketball, just 13 turnovers, 17 assists, a great job on the glass. Combine that with 34 points in the paint and 18 steals for the Falcons. That's a pretty good showing. It sure is. I thought actually Navy did pretty well rebounding the basketball through this game. They just killed themselves with so many turnovers. As we take a look at some of the highlights from this basketball game, it was all Air Force early on, led by Camry Heath. She was fantastic as we see the Air Force Falcons raising the NIT banner, there is Camry Heath right on cue, 27 points for her. She was unstoppable, mid-range game was on fire. That three right there to end the first quarter, that gave her so much confidence. She was running downhill after that, really drove the Falcons forward. Love, love that from Heath, and she was doing it on both ends. I mean, defensively coming up with steals, being aggressive, new career high for Camry Heath. That's what you want out of your senior. What can you say about Nikki McDonald? She was phenomenal so far, or this afternoon as well. Finished with her first career double-double, 12 points, 10 rebounds. Madison Smith, the sophomore, was a huge spark off the bench early in this game. Finished with a career high as well, 17 points. A career high for a, a record-setting afternoon for the Falcons across the board. And as we'll take a look, maybe quite possibly Oh, we got one more stat here. Again, it was, she was scoring too much. <laughs> Madison Smith, again, 17 points. And as we take a look, the Falcons 2-0 to start the season. And the big storyline today, Coach Gobrek and her 600th career win, 43 years of her coaching in this game. Shout out to Coach Gobrek, a true legend in our game. And what a stat that is, 600, as you said, for Coach Gobrek. What a performance it was from the Air Force Falcons. 40 points, they defeat Navy on Veterans Day. Roland Vargish, Rachel Galligan, we're going to sign off. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, the men are coming up next against the Blue Hens of Delaware from our entire Falcon Vision crew. Stephen Cohen, Matt Ruggles, Vince Greco, Pedro Lombach, and Brandon Idol, and my director, Brian German. This has been an absolute pleasure on Veterans Day. Falcons, they win 90-50 over Navy. We'll see you next for Air Force Men against the Blue Hens of Delaware.